this way leads to the Yaga Choling Monastery. Where is the monastery? Where is the monastery? And what is the monastery? Sakya. Sakya Guru Monastery. No, old monastery. and walking and walking and the peculiar thing I found of this mountain people is that when you ask them for directions they will just say Samne hai, it's just nearby it's five minutes or three minutes but when you cover the two minutes it will take you around 20 minutes Right now I feel that I am at the most serene place in the world. So much calmness all around me, small children playing behind me, cool wind blowing, it's not too chilly. And guess where am I? I am at the Guru Sakya Monastery. Now, I want to know something more about this monastery. I couldn't find that in, on Google. So I'm going to go, uh, go inside this monastery and find out the history of this place. Thank you. 
here in this Sakya Guru Monastery, I met Mr. Samdin, who told a lot about this Sakya Guru Monastery. And right now, as I told you, that they are preparing. And right now, as I told you, that they are preparing for something. They are, and Mr. Samdin will tell me what are they preparing for. So, Mr. Samdin, what are you preparing for? Uh, what is this is uh, preparing for in uh, Namgyal Puja from tomorrow. Namgyal Puja. Uh, what, what is this puja for? This is long life. For long life. Long life yes. So, anyone can join or yeah, sure. anyone, okay, can, anyone, anyone, anyone? Anyone can anyone join. Can From what time the puja? Maybe, uh, 5 a.m. 5 a.m. Yes. Till? 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 Till maybe 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock. Yes. Okay, okay. 3 hours. Maybe. 3, Three hours. hours. Okay. <laughs> so, here at Sakyaguri Monastery, I learned a lot of things about this monastery, about Buddhism, about the culture. And I also met Mr. Samdin, who now became my friend and he also subscribe to my YouTube channel and I made friend with a uh, little boy whose name is Tenzin who is going to Nepal tomorrow uh, this Monday and he's so happy that he's going back to his home in Nepal that he gave us these chocolates uh, it's so nice of him now it's time to leave the monastery and go to the next spot Flags you see fluttering in the wind are prayer flags. They come in five colors: yellow, green, red, white, and blue. Each color has a meaning. It is believed that the more these flags flutter in the wind, and the more it, the color of this uh, uh, flag fades away, it means the prayer of whoever has. Install the flag is being heard by the gods. Buddhist temple and peace pagoda. I'm out of breath because instead of taking a car from Chorasta, I thought of walking till here. Google Maps shows it's around 2.3 kilometers, but the thing is that that 2.3 kilometers you have to climb, and the climb is a very steep one. Close to the Japanese temple is the Peace Pagoda. The Peace Pagoda showcases four avatars of Lord Buddha. From the top of the Peace Pagoda, 
you will get a panoramic view of the Darjeeling landscape. Right now, I'm walking around the Peace Pagoda, enjoying the serenity over here. So if you like this video, please do like, comment in the comment box and please subscribe to my channel, The Yellow Scar. Thank you.